Excel macros are a great way to automate repetitive tasks. But did you know there's an even better alternative that 90% of Excel users don't know about? It's called Office Scripts, and today we'll show you exactly how it works. Let's jump in. Exploring the Automate tab in Office Scripts. Depending on your Excel version, you may see an Automate tab in the ribbon. It's a hidden gem in Excel that helps you save time by running tasks automatically. Inside it, you'll find Office Scripts, pre-built or custom sets of recorded steps for common tasks. If you don't see the tab, here's how to enable it. Go to any tab, right-click, choose Customize the Ribbon. On the right side, Main Tabs, tick Automate, then click OK. Now you'll see the Automate tab in your ribbon. Inside Automate, here are the main options. Record actions, capture your steps, and turn them into a script. New script, write or edit automation code. Office scripts, all scripts, run, manage, or reuse existing scripts. If you click on Office Scripts, All Scripts, the Code Editor panel opens up on the side. Below that, your recent scripts, the ones you've already created. Here at the top, there's the New Script option, where you can start fresh or paste your own code. And under Samples, you'll find a bunch of ready-to-use examples, like moving rows between tables, highlighting blank cells, or even removing duplicates all just one click away. Let's first try out a few sample scripts to understand how they work, and then we'll move on to creating our own script for real-life tasks. First, example one, highlight all blank cells. Suppose we want to highlight all blank cells in this table. Select the table with Control plus A. From the samples, choose Highlight Blank Cells. Click Run the script. Instantly, all empty cells are highlighted yellow. If you type a value, the highlight disappears. Delete it, and it reactivates. Super simple. That's a very simple example, but it shows the power of Office Scripts. Automate repetitive tasks instantly without needing to code VBA macros from scratch. Next, example two, remove hyperlinks. Now let's try one of the samples. Suppose we want to remove all the hyperlinks from a sheet leaving just the plain text behind. This is super handy when you paste data from the web and just want plain text. I'll show you how to run the built-in sample and how to tweak it if you need to. Under Samples, find Remove Hyperlinks. Press the Run button. Hyperlinks will be removed, but the text will stay. Next, Example 3. Pivot table with Office Scripts. Now, let's try something more advanced. Suppose we want to see the sum of sales by country. Here's how we can do it. Press Control plus A to select the entire dataset. And run the script that creates a pivot table. This isn't your average pivot. It comes preloaded with sales totals, a visual chart, and even slicers to filter by country with just one click. Quick, clean, and automated. Next, example four. Remove duplicates. Another useful sample is Remove Duplicates. Instead of manually using Excel's built-in Remove Duplicate tool every time, you can run this script in one click and clean your data instantly. Select the table or range of cells you want to clean. Under Samples, scroll down and choose Remove Duplicates. Click the Run button. Duplicates are removed automatically, leaving only unique values.
If you want, open Edit. Advanced Edit to change which columns S. The script checks for duplicates. Save and rename it so you can reuse the script in other workbooks. Example 5. Creating a drop-down list. Another useful script is creating a drop-down list. Say we want a drop-down of all countries. In this column. First, select them. Then, scroll down to the sample scripts and look for the one labeled Create a Drop-down. Run that script, and you'll notice Excel generates a new sheet containing a drop-down list with all of the countries from our selection. If you're not sure what a sample script does, you can always explore it further. For example, if we want to understand what text to number means, just click the three dots, choose edit code, and you'll see a green description at the top explaining its purpose. Below that is the actual code that runs the task automatically. We've gone through a few examples, but there are plenty more samples to explore. Now it's your turn. Go ahead and try out these scripts yourself. While Excel provides quite a few sample tasks, they won't cover every scenario you might need. That's why it's powerful to create your own custom tasks from scratch. And that's what we'll show you next. Custom Task Automation. Now let's jump into something really powerful, creating your own custom task from scratch without writing a single line of code. We're back in Excel with the Automate feature. Imagine every month you receive sales data by country, January, February, March, and so on. Each time, you want to quickly format the table and add a visual on the side. Instead of repeating the same steps manually, we can record them once and reuse them. Here's how. Click on Recorded Actions on the left. You'll see a short instruction panel, basically telling you to start performing actions so Excel can track them. Let's begin by selecting Country and January. Change the fill color to dark blue. Make the font white and to bold it. Notice on the right, Excel is keeping track of everything you do. If you don't want a step, you can remove it by pressing the little X. Next, let's reformat the numbers. Select the range, press Ctrl plus one to open formatting. Set zero decimal places and add a thousand separator. Already, the table looks much cleaner. Now, let's sort the data so the highest values appear on top. Go to Sort and Filter, Filter, and choose Largest to Smallest. Finally, let's add a chart. Press Ctrl plus A to select the whole area. Go to Insert, Recommended Charts, and pick one that works. Move it to the side, and now our data has a nice visual. Once done, simply click Stop Recording. Excel creates a script for you, which you can rename. For example, Custom. You can also add a description and control who can run or edit it. From now on, whenever you receive new data, say February sales, you don't need to repeat all the steps. Just press your format script, and within seconds, Excel applies all the same formatting and visuals automatically. At this point, you might be thinking, wait, isn't this just like macros? And that's exactly what we're going to clarify next. So is Office Scripts actually better than macros? Let's break it down. One of the biggest differences is that Office scripts are saved to OneDrive. This means you can reuse them across future workbooks. For example, if I press Ctrl plus N to open a brand new Excel file, I can still go to the Automate tab and find my saved scripts, like the format task we just created, ready to use in any file. Another advantage is sharing and integration. You can share Office scripts online with other users. Now. So far, we've been recording tasks, but we haven't actually looked at the code Office Scripts generates. Let's check that out and choose Advanced Edit. Here you'll see all the code with descriptions in green text. 
Each section has a short explanation, followed by the actual code. You'll notice the descriptions are marked with two backslashes, double forward slashes. For example, if we scroll to the bottom, we'll see the code that creates our chart. Right now, the data range is set from B4 to C12. If we wanted to include an extra row for another country, we could simply adjust it to C13. At first glance, this code might look intimidating, but the combination of explanations and structured layout makes it surprisingly easy to understand. And that's the power of Office scripts, faster, smarter, and way more flexible than traditional macros. Try them out in your own Excel files, and you'll see how much time you can save. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more tutorials.